Lewy body dementia is the second most common form of dementia after Alzheimer's. It affects millions of families worldwide, and most people have never heard of it. Regrettably, Lewy body dementia is often misdiagnosed or not recognized by the medical community. Dr. James Galvin of the Comprehensive Brain Institute is one of the world's most renowned Lewy body dementia experts. He's been diagnosing and treating patients for over 25 years. Lewy body dementia is the second most common cause of memory problems after Alzheimer's disease and has specific criteria that help us make this diagnosis. Uh, it's a progressive change in memory and thinking functions, uh, signs of Parkinson's or slowed movements, uh, visual hallucinations, fluctuations, that's alterations in attention and concentration, and REM sleep disorder. This is people acting out their dreams. A patient may appear sleepy or drowsy during the day despite the fact they slept the night before. Uh, the patient may have train of illogical or incoherent thoughts. So you may ask them a question and they give you an answer, but the answer is not to the question that you asked. These are very, very common symptoms found in 70 to 80 percent of all cases, but very, very difficult to diagnose. Norma Loeb made it her life's mission to help others after her mother died from Lewy body dementia. One of the main reasons for providing resources for families is because they have nowhere else to turn. Nobody else understands the disease. It took me a year to navigate where to find the right doctor. Where do I get home health aids? How do I get a hospital bed? And people have asked me these questions and I never wanted them to go through what I went through. Norma launched the Lewy Body Dementia Resource Center in New York to provide both patients and caregivers with Lewy Body information on a local level, and she did it with a personalized approach. Norma is now expanding these nonprofit services to Florida and many other states. When families and patients are looking for, for assistance, when they're looking for ways they can find information, one of the great ways to go about do this is to look at the Lewy Body Resource Center. So this is a, uh, a group that set up a website and, and large amounts of information to provide additional services for families and for patients. We wanted to incorporate and help as many people as possible because we know how much care, support, and specifically love is needed in caring someone. And our plan is to have a physical location, first in New York, where we can have physical therapy done, music therapy, and art. With such a large patient population suffering from Lewy body dementia, it is absolutely vital that medical professionals and families understand the symptoms and treatments for this disease. For more information or to find out how you can help, visit LewyBodyResourceCenter.org.